with Captain Jarrett. We're going to check out a schooner yacht. So what exactly is a schooner yacht? So a schooner, well, a schooner is a type of sailing vessel. A yacht is kind of a more general term yeah. based off of size. It's kind of one of those subjective things. Some people say 42 and over, whatever it is. A schooner is a two-masted sailing vessel. Uh, the furthermost uh, mast to the rear of the boat to the stern is taller than the forward one. And it's a traditional rig that was used a lot in merchant ships and um, all matter of things. Pirates used to love to steal them because they're <laughs> fast and they can, you know, kind of outrun like a large frigate and things like that. They're a little more nimble. Um, so schooner, two masts, one in the rear being taller than the one in the front. Okay. All right. So let's check it out. All right, so down below, Deliverance is a lovely little vessel. Uh, she's kind of in the uh, kind of 1940s range of design, so a little more Spartan than uh, you might find in a modern vessel, but really nice for those who are looking for that sort of classic sailing experience. We've got a double berth here. We have two singles all the way forward. We got a nice full galley. Stove, oven. Captain Jay! Oh, we looking good. I love it. Captain Jay! I love it. It's better than what Riley calls me. Captain Jay! My youngest daughter calls me Captain Porkchop. Captain Porkchop! <laughs> yeah. That's her, new, that's her new thing. No one's going anywhere without a bottle of rosé. That's for sure. And some nice cheese. Yeah, we homeschooled Arden and her sister because we live on a boat, so we move around so much. Only way to do it, boat school. Boat school. Boat school. Schooners are kind of, uh, traditionally, they have the wheel mounted like as such with the post going backwards. It seems, you know, generally you're used to the wheel holding it and you're standing behind it. <laughs> Get the Verrazano from a distance, kind of see a little bit of everything from here. And it's really quiet. There's a lot of great birding down here. We got seals down here. Sea turtles come in here. There are, there are quite a few actually, yeah. And there's, actually, for the past about three or so years, uh, some have been kind of maintaining themselves here in Jamaica Bay. You know, the, the two islands that are just south of the Verrazano Bridge that nobody lives on, they used to be kind of tuberculosis hospital islands and stuff. So there's no structures on them. They have a lot of seals on those islands. Uh, uh, Swinburne, Swinburne and Hawthorne Islands, those are called. I don't know how you remember all this. Yeah, they have a lot of seals on them. So I think the seal population's gotten pretty tight there and they're kicking them out they're like all right you gotta go yeah there's been a few down here it's pretty cool it's nice to see so much wildlife coming back you know I mean in the 80s Jamaica Bay was like you know people were like it's done it's never coming back the fishing here is excellent you know the birding is excellent it's just it's incredible for considering where it was you know 30, 40 years ago. This, so yeah, the whole the whole bay is actually it's the only wildlife refuge inside of a major city in the entire country. So it is the only one. So we're actually recording right now. Okay, so kind of see, try. And you can it has like a screen around. on it. Yeah, it's kind of like a. Where do you want me to try and keep this? Uh, oh yeah. 
this? Uh, it's good. It's good. It's a good question. Uh, like it depends on what you're trying to capture, but really, like within the cockpit, is probably the only like place that we can keep an eye on it. I wouldn't put it on deck. 